Huh? What is your skin made up of? Epidermis. The top layer of our skin makes new skin cells as well as protects us from germs, sun, and the rain. Also, it contains melanin, the pigment which gives our skin its color. Hmm. Dermis, the middle layer, is responsible for producing sweat as well as keeping our skin strong, flexible, and smooth. Also, it is Dermis's responsibility to tell us if something is too hot or cold. Hmm. Hypodermis, or fatty layer, is the bottom most layer. It protects our bones and muscles from injuries during a fall. Hmm. Huh? Why exactly are butterfly wings so colorful? Firstly, butterflies get their color from chemical pigments such as melanin, which absorb certain wavelengths of light while reflecting others. Secondly, butterflies' wings are made up of thousands of transparent microscopic scales. Also, each scale has multiple layers separated by air. Hence, when light passes through these scales, it is reflected multiple times. These reflections compound one another and intensify the colors. <laughs> hmm. Why does our heart beat faster when we feel threatened? In stressful situations, a part of our brain called the amygdala generates a response of fear or danger and sends it to the hypothalamus. Now, the hypothalamus activates our fight or flight system, which in turn causes the release of adrenaline. Adrenaline increases our breathing rate, elevates our blood pressure, and most importantly, it makes our heart beat faster than normal. This allows more oxygen and glucose to reach our cells through blood, giving us a burst of energy and thus making us capable to fight or flight. Hmm. <laughs> what are birthmarks? Birthmarks are colored marks on our skin which are present at birth or appear shortly afterwards. Birthmarks are of two types, vascular and pigmented. Vascular birthmarks are caused when a lot of blood vessels clump together, or they are stretched wider than usual. Pigmented birthmarks are generally caused when cells called melanocytes grow together in clusters. Birthmarks may also be inherited sometimes, and some of them may be similar to marks on other family members. <laughs> huh? Why do men have deeper voices than women? According to a research, during prehistoric times, males had to fight for females. So deeper voices allowed them to appear more intimidating and dominant, thus scaring their opponent away. Now, let's see how this deep voice is produced. The size of larynx or voice box is greater in males as compared to females. Hence, the vocal folds or cords present within the larynx lengthen as well as thicken. As a result, when males speak, the folds vibrate less per second, thus producing a deeper voice. Hmm. 